Hi, I'm Daniel with Interpan Building Systems. Today, I'm going to show you how easy it is to use our structural insulated metal panel for your wall and roof applications. We are going to do a short time lapse video of the building behind me, and I'll walk you through the building to show you some of the features of our design and how you might be able to use it on your next project. Similar to the techniques used in cold form seal construction, the wall track is the first member laid down and fastened to the floor. This member, with integrated rain lip, ties the walls firmly to their foundation. For industrial modular buildings, this means setting the track with self-tapping screws or drilling holes and securing the channel with quarter inch bolts and washers. Once the track is secured, your team is ready to start setting the wall panels. For this building, Interpan's fire rated CFS panels were used. This advanced composite panel contains every major performance element of the wall system. Made in our factory in Alberta, the design of this panel is anchored by a foamed in place polyurethane core. The insulating values delivered by these panels outperform traditional construction methods by as much as 60%. Set into that foam is a 14 gauge steel stud providing the primary framing for the building. When placed side by side, this gives the building a traditional 24 inch stud spacing for mounting heavy equipment such as VFD panels and tiered cable trays. Protecting the insulation and providing building code compliance is a 5 8 inch piece of modified sheetrock. When used in combination with our factory supplied sealants, this creates a 1 hour fire barrier for the wall assembly. Finishing out the panel and providing additional protection is an unbroken shell of 26 gauge galvanized steel. Coated with a variety of colors, this skin comes with a standard 30 year color fast warranty. So when you're using this panel as a single component in your walls, you can be certain that these panels will look just as good at the end of the equipment's life cycle as they did in the beginning. As you can see in the video, building with CFS panels is an easy and efficient process. Simply apply the factory supplied sealant to the interior flange of the panel and place it into position to complete the lap joint. Once bonded together, self-tapping screws or rivets are used to secure the panel into place. Fasteners are placed 18 inches apart on both sides of the lap joint and along the wall track tying the system together. These lap joint panels make such a strong connection that multiple panels can be fastened together prior to erection to further speed up the assembly process. When we say that the Interpan building system is more efficient, we mean it. Consider how many touch points and types of work were required in your last project. Traditional methods for industrial projects require the use of welded steel frames or individually fastened studs and then the attachment of an exterior corrugated metal sheet. From there, bat insulation must be installed and the interior of the wall finished off with yet another type of corrugated metal panel. That is four separate applications of material, each with their own waste, supply chain responsibilities, and unique attachment method. Interpan's approach provides instant efficiency by building all of these elements into one manageable wall panel section which is installed with the simplest of tools. On average, Interpan's panel systems are 60% faster than traditional methods and equate to a 28% savings on the overall build. For our customers who do not have the available in-house resources to assemble their own buildings, Interpan has two options for you. We have a certified network of installers who can come to your shop or we can ship you a completed building from one of ours. Once all the wall panels are up, a top cap is applied to finish tying the walls together. This wall cap also provides a secure footing from which to anchor the roof system. A strip of non-hardening butyl sealant is applied to the wall cap, protecting the interior from water intrusion. Unlike traditional construction methods, the same composite CFS panels used for the walls are employed for the roof as well. This product versatility helps to compact construction timelines and maximize workforce effectiveness. Roof panels can either be set in sections with the help of cranes or handed up one at a time by team members. Once in position, these roof panels are anchored to the walls with 6 inch self drilling screws on 12 inch centers. These roof panels tie the building together and set the final squareness of the building. Before moving past this step, Make any micro adjustments necessary to ensure that your building is completely square.
After the roof panels are set, eave and rake flashing are applied to divert rainwater and finish off the walls. The addition of the eave flashing marks the lockup milestone common to construction and signals the ability for other trades to begin work inside the building. The building shown here just went from a bare skid to a structural sound enclosure in two days. We are confident that with a little practice, your team can achieve similar results. Now, let's move on to the finishing touches. Roofing, equipment penetrations, and doors are primary elements in most buildings and also the biggest opportunities for the intrusion of water. The primary goal is to keep you water tight while still allowing passage in and out of the building. To this end, our engineers have developed solutions to make it as easy as possible for your team to be successful, and we pack them into every kit we supply. Let's take a moment to focus on these big three. To accommodate environmental conditions across North America, various snap lock standing seam roofs are available. While not required for every project, applying a metal roof over the top of your roof panels is the best way to ensure water tightness. Standing seam roofs also provide additional aesthetic appeal and allow for the easy installation of curbs for vertical exhaust ducting as well as the addition of gutters and downspouts to direct water away from your building. Moving down the roof line, the next opportunity for water intrusion is usually at the wall penetrations. From louvers and exhaust fans to conduit and piping, Interpan has a penetration solution for you. We offer customized flashings, laser cut gland plates, and gasketed discussion rings to keep your project watertight and aesthetically complete. One often overlooked area of water ingress is improperly installed doors. Stepped thresholds, rain lips, rubber gasket door jams, astrals and sweeps are all supplied to ensure that this does not happen to you. It is best to save installing these to last to prevent them from being damaged. Alignment adjustments can be made to the door frame post installation to make sure that the doors swing level and that all margins are symmetrical. And there you have it. With the Interpan building system, we were able to go from an open skid to an enclosed instruction in just two days. After adding the standing seam roof, trim, the door hardware, and the air conditioner behind me, this building was completed in five. After that, the electricians were able to get to work, and this East House is ready for its customer. If you found this video informative, please reach out to our website. We'd love to see how we can help you apply additional value to your customers. Thank you for watching.